So this is our 14 foot tiny house. As you can see, we have a large 48 by 48 window in the main studio bedroom area, as well as a large glass door on the front. On this unit, we have black aluminum windows versus your standard white vinyl windows. As we go to this side of the house, we can see a couple things. We have an outdoor outlet here that allows us to plug in anything that we might want to run off the side of the house. This tiny house runs off a 50 amp breaker. You can run the tiny house up 20 amps. So you could plug it into say your main house outdoor circuit and run the AC and the lights and everything else inside. But we recommend plugging this into a 50 amp circuit. This is the electrical box cabinet area. We have a 50 amp main as well as two dedicated kitchen outlets that are each 20 amps. On this 14 foot tiny house, we used a 12,000 BTU mini split as well as a liquid propane on demand outdoor water heater. This water heater delivers unlimited hot water and also ensures that any kind of fumes or gases are left outside. So as we come inside the tiny house, the first thing that we notice are these walls. These are maple walls with solid maple trim as well as solid maple casing on both the bathroom and living area window. And the floor is also an engineered maple. The mini split inside the house is our indoor unit of our 12,000 BTU mini split. Right now in this tiny house, we have it set up with a full size bed, but you can set it up with a futon or you can set it up as an office. There's plenty of room inside. As we walk into the bathroom here, we notice that we have our alcove shower unit also supplied with a beautiful extra large rain shower. On the ceiling, we can also see our LED lights as well as our bathroom exhaust fan. And this is a pretty strong bathroom exhaust fan. So in this studio tiny house, our kitchen has plenty of storage above the counter and as well plenty of storage below the counter. Inside of the under sink cabinet area, we also have included a mini fridge. The kitchen also has two dedicated 20 amp outlets. So each outlet there is on its own 20 amp circuit, meaning that you could connect say a microwave and a toaster oven at the same time. So even though this unit is only a 14 foot trailer, it feels big in here, especially with the higher ceilings, the large windows, it really has a great open feel. I think this tiny house is perfect for somebody looking for a mother-in-law suite or even somebody that's going to Airbnb their own house and wants something nice to stay in. Thanks for taking a look at our 14 foot NOAA certified tiny house.